हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टेलिंग यू अबाउट ए वेबसाइट वेयर यू कैन जस्ट जनरेट रैंडम इमेजेस एट योर चॉइस सो द वेबसाइट नेम इज लॉरम फ्लिकर सो इफ यू गो टू गूगल एंड टाइप हेयर दिस वेबसाइट विच इज लॉरम फ्लिकर सो दिस इज नेम ऑफ द वेबसाइट द फर्स्ट रिजल्ट विच comes in this is a website free placeholder images so if you want to generate static random images for your application you can just use this website it provides free free placeholder images you just need a image tag and then you just manipulate the source attribute to this address so which is https lorenflicker.com slash the width and the height of the image here i am providing 320 slash 240 if i go to go to this link it will generate a random image of this dimension so this is a very handy website if you want to generate if you want to test static images data so let me just show you this example inside my application i will be making a html5 application and inside this i will have a simple image tag and the source attribute i will copy paste this this url like this so this is a url you can see that https lorenflicker.com/320/240 this is the width and the height if i refresh it you will see a static image which is coming here with these dimensions i can even change this to let's suppose uh, 500 and 240 so this time the width will become 500 and the height will remain 240 so this is a very handy example let me just make it as dynamic so that i can just uh, instantly let me just provide a id to this image tag img and then i will have two input of number here i will be providing a id to it of width and also to this height so basically then i will have a simple submit button value is get image like this let me just wrap this all this inside a form a id of form like like this so just wrap this inside the form tag so just after this button we have this form tag and also paste this image right after the form here so paste this and now inside the javascript we just need to first of all target this form document dot get element by id form like this and then we can attach the form add event listener so when the form submits like this we will attach a a event object like this first of all we will call event dot prevent default and then we will get the width of the image like this document dot get element by id the width the id that we have given and to extract the value we will write dot value and to get the height also you can just write document dot get element by id height dot value like this and now after getting the width and height we can just attach we can just construct the url dynamic url so we will use the backtick symbol inside this we can just paste it the url so basically if i go to the website and just show you lorem flicker so this is a website so in order to get this let me just copy link address so copy it and now i will paste the height like this the width like this sorry so basically this is a url now we just need to attach this to the image element so first of all we just need to target it by dot L get element by id image and image dot source will be equal to url that's it so this is a application if i refresh it and right now if i provide width and height to 455 get image you will see it will get a image with these dimensions 455 455 i can even change this to 800 height so if i click get image you will see that it will get a image with these dimensions the nice thing about you can right click save image as to your local system and let me change the width to 1250 so it will get these 
get the image instantly with these dimensions you can see that so this is a website guys lauramflickr.com a free placeholder images website so thanks very much for watching this video